Dozens of people came out to honor a murdered 16-year-old girl at the football game she should have been cheering in. ABC 13's Daniela Hurtado spoke with the girl's mother tonight about the tragedy and her call for justice. Daniela. Erica, tonight a show of support for a student whose life was cut short. There are a lot of questions on who, why, and what happened to 16-year-old Lizbeth Medina. Tonight, her mother in a tearful interview opens up and tells us she believes her daughter's killer is no stranger. Shades of purple all around the Cypher FCU Stadium during Thursday night's playoff football game. It was a favorite color of 16 year old Edna High School cheerleader Lizbeth Medina, who's described as sweet, giving, and compassionate. It makes me feel proud and amazed of just seeing how many people loved her. It's been a heavy few days for Jacqueline Medina, who tells us she found her daughter dead in their Edna home on Tuesday. Nobody ever wants to see their child in the bathtub. The way I found her. Nobody. The curtains were closed, so I didn't see her. But when I opened those curtains, I just want justice for my baby. The Edna police say Liz's death is being investigated as capital murder. At this point, investigators have not released how she died. Lizbeth knew the person because there was no signs of a fourth century. So she knew the person. Tonight, Jackie, surrounded by those who love her, drove nearly two hours from Etna to Cyprus for a game her daughter should have been on the sidelines for cheering. This is still a nightmare for me. And like I said, um, I'm just here because I want to show that Liz is still here with them. As investigators work to figure out who did this, under the lights tonight, a memorial along with her cheer shoes for a girl whose life was taken too soon. Dozens of people honored her life through a moment of silence. In Cyprus, Daniela Hurtado, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.